everyone, in today's video I'm doing something extremely different because I'm doing a speed paint instead of a speed build. So I had this idea to try to combine my love of art and The Sims 4 and I chose um, four different paintings from the game and I put up a poll on Instagram and Twitter asking what everyone would like to see me try to paint myself, like to recreate. And um, this picture, I'll put it somewhere here, is um, what was chosen. So I will be showing you a really quick video of how I painted it. And at the end, stay tuned because I'm going to kind of talk about my ideas for this whole kind of painting series, if that's what it turns into. So um, I hope you like the video. And again, I will be right back.
it turned out pretty okay, I think. Um, I mean, of course, it's not perfect. Uh, the yolk should be a little bit more centered and a little bit bigger, but um, yeah, I think it's all right. And of course, the colors are not perfect. I usually try to like really color match um, things when I'm like recreate or like painting a still life or you know things like that portrait. But um, I wasn't going for perfection necessarily for this. I was just trying to make it fun and do it kind of quick. I, I got it done in one sitting, so I was pretty happy with that. It took me like three and a half hours total, like from start to finish to do this. So, you know, I just thought I would try something different because I, um, so the reason I wanted to do this is because I am somewhat of an artist. I've not been able to really paint or draw since I started doing Sims things. So I wanted to try to find a way to combine the two of them so that I don't have to choose one or the other. And even if it's just, you know, like something that I do maybe once a month, I think that that's still um, a good way to keep me motivated and to keep me kind of creating art. And um, also I, I wanted to use it as a way to kind of connect with people a little bit more. Um, I was thinking of creating like a a hashtag where people can um, tag me in screenshots of maybe their sim self or maybe a screenshot of a house that they built that they're really happy with and um, like if they're interested in seeing me try to paint it or like you know recreate it as a painting or I guess if it's a sim it's essentially doing their portrait <laughs> but as their sim so or it could it could just be like any sim that you create also um and so i was thinking of of um i mean i don't know exactly what the hashtag would be necessarily i was thinking of maybe doing like hashtag simply tiara paint this or but at the same time i don't know if i always want to paint maybe sometimes i might do a drawing so i don't know if you have any suggestions as to what i should use for the hashtag if you guys like this idea of course i don't want to like keep doing it if nobody even likes it so um but please let me know let me know what you think about the video let me know if you like the idea of doing that if it's something that um maybe you might even tag me in <laughs> like if you have something specific that you want me to try to paint um otherwise i might just continue um i might continue doing like recreations of paintings that are already in the game so it's i don't know so at least it's something you know like if people don't want to actually participate and have me paint something that they create or whatever. I'll, maybe I'll just keep painting things that are in the game. But I thought that that would be a cool way to, again, like connect with people a little bit more, like the people who subscribe to me or who follow me on Instagram or whatever. And um, also I have a Society6 account and it's where you put your artwork on like different products that people can buy. So it can be like coffee mug, t-shirt, or you can just get like a big print of it you know, as an art piece, and, um, and so I was thinking if I put some of my Sims artwork on there, if people are really like it, they could, you know, order something as, like, their coffee mug, or if they could have their portrait Sim self on a t-shirt or something like that, I don't know, but, uh, yeah, I guess, I guess I'll wait to see how, um, how all of this goes, and if it's something that, everyone really likes. I hope that I can make it happen. So, um, I also just reached 300 subscribers, um, like a day or two ago. And I just want to say thank you so much because it really means a lot. I mean, this is hard work actually, <laughs> like to keep doing this. And, um, and if you don't know, I have three kids and I'm currently homeschooling, uh, for the most part, like mostly my, my younger son. Um, I have to homeschool him because of the whole pandemic thing and it's just, it's really stressful and I haven't been able to work. I've been furloughed from my job since March and so I've been kind of do this, I, I've been doing this to kind of keep me working <laughs> in a way. I mean, it's work, but um, unfortunately I'm not getting paid for it. So, uh, but I really appreciate everyone that does so support my content and um, if you have not subscribed yet, please do, and um, I really appreciate it, and it will really help me out, because if if I can eventually get on, to, like, the partner program thing, I mean, that would be amazing, because then I could actually, you know, put all of this time and effort and work into this and have it come back to me in a way, so, 
Um, but yeah, I guess that's all I really wanted to say. Yeah, and again, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!